Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm honored to have been selected to be part of the NSTF Brilliance Program, and I'm truly grateful for this opportunity. My name is Aishwarya Matthew. I come from Queenstown, a very small town in the Eastern Cape. I matriculated from Queenstown Girls High School in 2021. I never realized how small a world I came from until I went to the University of Cape Town and primarily met people from the big cities, Joburg, Cape Town, and Durban. However, I take pride in having a humble beginning. Ironic, I know. I'm currently studying medicine at UCT. Committing to studying medicine was a last minute call, specifically only at the beginning of matric. For some reason, the moment one expresses interest in studying medicine, the question that pairs hand in hand with this declaration is, well, why do you want to become a doctor? I was never able to verbalize why I wanted to study medicine. So I had to trace my thoughts back to level five lockdown in 2020, when I had to self-study my schoolwork. When there was no rigid school system to instill discipline, I, like many others, had to find an internal drive. The source of that drive each day was learning content about health sciences beyond the scope of the school curriculum. I slowly realized that studying medicine would be why I would want to sit at my desk each day for hours and practicing surgery later on would be a reward for the studying. I'm someone who generally undermines what I know. Although grateful, I try not to become complacent with what I've achieved. This works for me because it forces me not to settle for what I already know, but to search for more to learn and master. This is what gives me purpose in life. Therefore, I hope to settle in a work environment that fosters learning and research, specifically in the areas of neuroscience or pathology. It has always deeply troubled me whenever I see friends and family wronged by negligence and apathy of health practitioners, where death sometimes is the price paid. Our healthcare system is brewing practices of injustice rooted in a lack of compassion. One hears cases where doctors delay diagnosing ailments because of a lack of basic observation. Delayed diagnoses risk patients' lives because the appropriate treatment comes too late. Therefore, I am motivated to become a doctor that patients trust, one that is committed to delivering the healthcare offered. I hope to contribute to reinstating fairness and justice in healthcare. Besides devoting my time to studying, I enjoy playing tennis, drawing, rapping and writing rap songs. So if medicine does not pan out well, I hope I can fall on my little musical talent. So watch out Eminem. As aforementioned, I never settle for what I know. Thus, I'm still learning more about myself. I'm still learning more about why medicine was the right choice. It probably sounds like there is a lot of uncertainty. However, this learning process is the most enjoyable journey on which I'm happy to be. It is filling what is unknown with answers that is my ultimate goal in life. Thank you.